Hey, in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a path to the SDK's tools and platform tools folder. These are two important folders uh, within which there are tools that are important to us. And the current instruction applies to both Macintosh as well as your Ubuntu Linux. So you can use the same procedures which I show you here. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to locate the SDK path I'm going to go to Finder and in Finder I'm going to go to my Macintosh HD and here within the DevTools folder I have unpacked my ADT bundle zip and this ADT bundle extracted folder contains the Eclipse and SDK. So inside SDK we have this platform tools folder and the tools folder which contains a set of tools that we would be using during Android development. So this is the path that we are interested in. And now I'm going to add these folders to the path environmental variable. To do that, I'm going to start my terminal. And here first, let me go ahead and get the paths. I'm going to type in cd slash devtools followed by ADT bundle. And here I have the SDK. And within SDK, I have the platform tools folder. Let me go ahead and type in PWD, which will print the working directory. And this is the path we are interested in. Let me copy this. And here I'm going to use my Vim editor to add these paths to my path in my on mental variable. So I'm going to type in sudo Vim followed by slash etc slash paths and when I type enter it's going to ask for my password which I'm going to type in oops so here I have uh, a file which contains paths delimited by new line characters that is you enter a path per line so we have multiple paths to insert Using Vim, I'm going to press on I and press enter, right click and click on paste. So now we have the platform tools folder. The other folder we are interested in is the tools folder. So right click, click on paste and here I'm going to delete platform. So I have the platform tools folder and I also have the tools folder. The next thing I'm going to do is to press escape colon and WQ press enter so that the changes are saved and if you want to verify if your paths file has been changed type cat followed by slash etc slash paths and you should be able to see the platform tools and the tools folder inside the paths folder so that's it that's how you set up your uh, path for the SDKs platform tools and the tools folder. That's about it. And if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Thank you.